So here we are. Oh, you're videoing. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I thought you were taking a picture. Yeah, taking our uh, first break um, here on the uh, Appalachian, well, actually the approach trail to the Appalachian Trail. And um, we're doing pretty good. We're about two miles in. It's uh, 3.53, so we got about an hour, hour and a half left of light, and we only got seven miles to go. Shouldn't be any problem reaching our goal. And Maybe about 10 o'clock tonight. Well, so <laughs> we started at like 2 o'clock. Yeah, well, we got to a late start, and we were doing really well. About a mile in, we've already been got lost twice. <laughs> <laughs> get lost he just missed a turn oh yeah had yeah to backtrack yeah had to backtrack okay. <laughs> <Two times. laughs> so, 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 so i'm really impressing my wife right now with my incredible orienteering yeah, skills I'm leading. <laughs> oh yeah but she's leading the way so um so at least i have plausible deniability it's like i would have made that turn but you know i was trying to follow you and you got too far ahead i couldn't catch her so, um, I was not ahead. <laughs> oh, yeah, she's like two steps ahead. But anyway, we're taking a break because um, we, need food. we need some food. <laughs> and uh, uh, just having a great time. <laughs> This is where the trail crosses. So this is our real first water crossing on the Appalachian Trail.
So earlier we saw this great spot by the water. We were on that trail up there going up that way, and uh, which is the AT. We saw this great spot right here by the water. We were looking at it and we we're thinking, hmm, and we just can't make it back to Springer Mountain Shelter tonight. So what we decided is to camp along this water and listen to this wonderful serenade of rushing water all night tonight and get up early. We're going to have a big, big day tomorrow because we're going to have a little over 12 miles to do to get back to our car. And uh, But we can do it, And uh, but we're not going to camp on this side. This tree is definitely one detriment. <laughs> this tree, I noticed, is uh, broken. And if you look at it, right there is where we were thinking was the most level spot, right there on the other side of that log. And this tree broke and fell and it is leaning into that tree on those branches where it could fall at any time probably will fall in the near future at some point it will give way and fall and so that's not the best place and what we decided is to go back over the bridge it's just a little ways further back towards Springer Mountain down the trail and go across the wooden footbridge and we're going to camp on the other side, which is definitely a little bit more, feels more like a stealth camp spot. Here's the water. That's what we're going to listen to all night. And right over there you can see Steve's pack. He said it's really perfect over there and there's a fire ring and a nice level spot. So that's where we're going to camp tonight. And uh, this should be an adventure. And the whole thing's an adventure and it's wonderful fun. hard at work getting us some fresh water with this wonderful little guardian water filter which is really great and gets all the bacteria and junk out and I sure do. Uh, two things. 